hey guys welcome back to my channel um in today's video what i want to do is just do like a little like makeup haul of all the things i've bought since um the last time i posted um i've bought uh several things it's like a lot um but i did want to show you guys the things that i do have right now um and it's been like these two bags but um like i said it is a lot but i just wanted to show you guys now i did try some of this makeup um today which it's probably like 11 30 at night right now but i really wanted to just um do a video showing you of the things that i have gotten and the things that i've liked i've tried new things from today and um yeah so if you want to um see what i have in this makeup haul keep watching so some of the stuff that i have used um i've put it up in like my makeup stuff but some of the things that i haven't used um i've just kept in the bag um but yeah so i did want to show you guys what i have so the first thing i'm gonna show you is this maybelline uh total temptation palette it was ten dollars but i got it for 4.99 and this is what it looks like and it's just like an eyeshadow palette i got this one at target but this is how it looks I also got the LA Girl Pro Matte um, Foundation and I got the shade Ivory but the shade Ivory um, was too light for me so this um, I won't be using it um, though I do have like the pigments I don't have all of them but I do have like two of the LA Girl the Pro Color Foundation pigment so I don't have the I think there's a blue one and I don't know the other one, but I don't, I don't have the other one. So I'm going to see if I can, um, mix this with those because I really don't want to just, you know, let the foundation go to waste. So, um, I'll have to figure something out on that one. So I also got the Physicians Formula All-Star Face Palette. And, um, basically it's a, it's two bronzers. Um, a blush, a highlight, and well, two highlights, two bronzers, and a blush. And then this is, um, what is that? It says powder palette multicolored press powder. That's what it says. But when you when you smell this, it smells so pretty. I want you guys to see this one. Okay. You see that highlight? It's like really pretty. I really fell in love with this one. With this um, little palette. I really liked it. And then for my eyes today, I used the Essence Fire Palette. And well, this is how the front looks like, and then oops, this is how it looks really pretty. So, this is um, basically what I used on my eyes today. Um, and then for a concealer today, I did use the Essence Camouflage Plus Matte Concealer. I but yeah, I did use these as concealer and um, for like just cream contour and i really liked it i really liked it so these are it and then i also got this garni um skin active uh micellar cleansing water so i did get this as well see a lot of people are using this so i said why not and then i also got this one for clearance this was longwear brow pomade in the shade auburn and it was 10.99 but they had it for 5.49 so this is another thing i got 
and i mean i really don't like doing my eyebrows mostly because i really don't know how to do them but i mean twist here so we're twisting it okay a spoolie okay oh so i'm zooming okay so but where's the brush so the palm aid is right here but i don't know where the brush is it's not come with the brush i could have i thought this came with a brush um okay there it is so there's the um brush for the brows it's right there if you can see it um so we got that okay so the next thing is this elf highlighter and this is in the shade white gold and um it's like really pretty so i'm gonna just apply it here it's like way lighter than this one but it's like really pretty really gotta put my finger there so it is this one uh you can't really see it but oh there you go you can see it a little bit so it's this one so i got this and then i also got um this is called the blush lighter i got two from essence and these are powder blushes so i have peachy dawn and then uh cassis sunburst i also have some stuff from dollar tree i want to show you so this is a brush that i got from dollar tree isn't that so cute can you see that look at the little rocks and this is just the angled contour brush and i got these from the dollar tree it's just like an angled brush it's really cute i haven't used it but i thought it was really cute and then i also got another one too and this is a powder brush and this one is from dollar tree as well um and it is so cute oh it has little hairs sticking up but yeah it's like feels really soft and look at the little things really cute really also the lashes that i'm wearing are from dollar tree i don't know if you can see them they're really really long so these lashes are from the dollar tree and it's in this packaging and this is called Ioni Ioni the 3D Fox Meek Lashes this is wispy full dramatic and um, honestly they're not bad so this is the little packaging so that's what where these lashes are from Dollar Tree and it's this one I think they had another, another style but I didn't get it so the next thing is this Maybelline. I think this is an eyeliner. Yeah, this eyeliner. This is in the color Rusty. Terracotta. Rusty Terracotta. And it's kind of like a red. I want to show you guys. I'm telling you, when I tell you... I got a lot of stuff. I got a lot of stuff and I had just been stocking it. So. So that is that. That is that color right there. Um, and then here's another thing I got in clearance. And the clearance, I got these. The clearance stuff I got at Target. So this is the L'Oreal. Uh. I can't read what it says. I, okay, so this is it. 
and this is the shade 360 and I mean they don't smell bad but so this one is this one you can see it yeah so I tried one of these and they honestly last on your look and then I got two more from L'Oreal so I have two other ones and one is a uh, rose blood which is 370 and then this one is 368 matador matador and then so this is a matador one can you see that yeah it's a really pretty like red i really really like it and then this is like a oops sorry i can't swatch this good but this is I wish that I could swatch it really pretty so you guys could see, but those are the colors that I have. <sighs> and then this I actually got from Walmart. These I thought were like $4.88 or something, but these were actually like $0.75, cents, I think, $0.75. Cents. So it's just like a sponge, which this is good um, for like when you're doing your baking and stuff. So, I also got this um, cream blush, and this is by Maybelline. This is shade Nude Burn, which is 15. And then, I don't think I've opened this. Oh, yeah, I have. Oh, so it doesn't have smell, but this is the blush. I don't know if you could see it. That one right there. This is the blush. That is the blush. So I got another blush from Essence. And this is the Berry Connection. And this is what it looks like. Really pretty. Really pretty. And then I got another blush. This is from Wet n Wild. And this is the shade Pinch Me Pink. This is from Wet n Wild. And then another thing from Wet n Wild is this uh, color icon bronzer. This is Ticket to Brazil. And I think this is like a shiny, it's like a little shiny um, bronzer. And I did get another bronzer. And this is from Essence, the Sun Club Matte Bronzing Powder for lighter skin. This is 01 Natural. So it's a look at the design on these. This is so cute. So I got this one. I also got this um, eyeliner. It's a gel liner. And this was from Maybelline. The shade is Charcoal. Got this on clearance too, but this is it. It's just like a gel liner. Um, I remember before doing my eyeshadow with, I mean, my eyeliner with um, uh, liquid, I used to use that one, but I picked it up again. Picked up this loose powder from CoverGirl, and this is Translucent Fair, shade 105, and it's just like a translucent powder. So I got that one. And then I also picked up another cover girl True Blend Minerals Loose Mineral Powder in the shade 50, which is translucent. So here's another translucent from Cover Girl. And then I also picked up another loose powder, which is from Hard Candy. And this is the Sheer Envy Loose Powder Shine Free Translucent. Yeah, so this one is another powder. So I have been looking and searching for a long time to get this foundation and I could not find it anywhere. And I finally went to Walmart the other day and I found it. It was um it was for the L'Oreal Inflatable Um Foundation in a powder and I got this shade 10 which was porcelain. 
and I was finally finally able to get it and I like it comes with this little sponge but um, I like that it has like a really big mirror and I haven't tried this but I'm pretty sure it's my shade because in the actual liquid one I wear a 405 and in the back it says that it's porcelain so this is the liquid one and then this is the powder one so I'm pretty sure they're they're the same so I'm very very excited because I could not find this one anywhere so um, I'm very excited so another thing I did want to show you guys is that um, I got like I was trying out some foundations from beauty creations and I got four shades very fair skin so sometimes with foundations, it's kind of hard. So I got the first four lightest ones. I got shade uh, 1.0 and then 1.5 and then 2.0 and then 2.5. So my shade actually, my shade actually ended up being 2.5. So um, if you didn't know, if you're trying to figure out what shade you are in this the beauty creation stay foundation i'm not sure the full name of it but if you're trying to figure out what shade you are you can actually order um like four of the shades and then they send them to you and i think i only paid like five dollars for the shipping because they don't charge you for these and um yeah, so now I know that I'm a shade 2.5, so now I get to order the actual foundation because actually I really like the foundation. I have it on currently, and honestly, I um I really, really like it. I really like it. It kind of reminds me of the uh, L'Oreal one, but when I tell you it looks really pretty, it looks really, really pretty really pretty so uh i do have more which these are concealers and um uh cream contours so i have the uh la girl pro conceal and i have the shade fairest and then i have the shade cool tan so i have these two and this one is really good i really like it and then I also got these on clearance. These are the Maybelline Camouflage Concealer. So I have the shade 10 Fair and 50 Medium. So these are another concealer and cream contour I have. I also have a BH Studio Pro Total Coverage Concealer. And... and I guess this is supposed to be a pink corrector. I'm not sure, but this is another one. I also do have a Makeup Revolution London Concealer. And I have the shade C1, which um, I really like this concealer as well. I also have the Juvia's Place um, Eye Primer in the shade 1. So this is another one. I also have the Wet n Wild um, All Day Full Coverage Concealer in the shade. What shade is this? Fair. So I really like this. I also have this one. I have been loving this um, translucent powder and it's from uh, Makeup Revolution London. The Baking Powder Translucent. Y'all. I love this one. I love this one. When I tell you I love it, I love it. And then I also have this LA Girl Luminous Glow Skin Illuminator in the shade Moonlight. So this you apply, I think you apply your primer, then you apply this on top of the primer, and then you apply your foundation, I think. So I haven't really used it. So this I have as well. And I did get, um, I did get new brushes, so these are like really, really soft, um, but yeah, I got new brushes as well, um, what else?
Yeah. Okay guys, so um, this concludes today's video. Um, I just wanted to get on here and um, just update you guys on the new stuff that I've gotten. Um, out of the stuff that I've shown you today, I've, I've used most of it and I really like it. Um, the only thing it did bum me out that um, I was not the shade of ivory. So that's the only thing because it's really, really wet on me. And um, so yeah, guys, that concludes for today's video. Let me know down in the comments what you guys thought about this video. If there's anything that you guys liked or if there's anything you guys uh, recommend me or things that um, you would like for me to try. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. And again, thank you guys for coming back. And I'll see you guys on the next one.